One of the most powerful features in our program is the search feature. It allows you to find a word or a phrase in a book. To start the search feature, just click on this icon here. To search for a word, you have to do three things. Number one, you have to type in a word here in the search for section. Number two, you have to select the books to search in. That is done here in the search in section. For my first example, I'll select the King James Bible. And number three, if you are searching for a word in a Bible, you have to tell the search feature how much of the Bible to search in. That's done here in the Bible search options section. Do you want to search the entire Bible? If you do, select do not filter. Do you want to only search the New Testament? Then click on the down arrow and select New Testament. Once you have done all these three things, click on the search button at the bottom. What comes up next is the search result window. I'm going to maximize the search result window and we're going to take a look at it together. The search result window contains a lot of information, but every bit of it can help you get the right results right now. At the top of the search result window, you will see the word that you searched. Right underneath that is the number of occurrences that word appears. So the word salvation appears in the King James Version 45 times in the New Testament because we only search the New Testament for the word salvation. So if you want to know how many times a word appears in a Bible or any book, you can use the search feature. You can also use the search feature to find out where that word appears. In the large pane at the bottom, we have three general columns. This column here lists the book that has your search word. This column here is the verse where your search word appears. And this large section at the right contains the sentence or the verse where your word appears in. If you want to open the King James Version to, let's say, Romans 10.10, 10, all you have to do is click on this Bible reference here, and the King James Bible will open to that verse. Now, since my search result window is covering the entire desktop, I have to click on this Arrange icon on the main toolbar. That will spread out my open books and if you look up here in the upper right corner, you'll see here is the King James Version, and it's open to Romans 10.10. So I use the search feature to help me find where the word salvation appears and to open a book to that verse where the word appears. If you want to know more about the search feature, just look through our list of other videos.